Hey, hey, fam. Thank y'all so much for being here with me, tuning in and tapping in. Y'all already know who and what it is, so let's just go and tap in with Spirit, get y'all a quick message real quick. I'm going to try not to make this too long, but y'all already know. <laughs> Anywho, y'all, thank y'all so much, all my subscribers, day one and new. Thank y'all so much for all the love and support. Ooh, child, yeah. <laughs> Baby, somebody here, they finna go through a real tower moment when it come to y'all. Something here, somebody is, it's like two towers hitting somebody at one time. Oh, child. What is going on? It got something to do with somebody's sexual energy as well. Oh, my God. I know damn well, y'all. Tap in, because see, somebody out here, they don't really did something with their mouth, and now they throw finna close up. So this could have been somebody... Uh, speaking ill on you. This could be a, a STD, but it's something going on here with somebody's mouth, their throat. It's, it feel like something is closing up here. So if somebody was speaking ill on your name, child, they finna lose their voice. They gonna have a really bad sore throat, something like that. Somebody cheating on you, baby, it's finna be well known because it's gonna be something going on with this person's mouth or their throat. Get y'all some uh inner fucking peace cards, child, because y'all already know. Protect your energy, fam. Yeah, but y'all know the messages are general. Take what resonates and leave what does not. They're also timeless, fam. So whenever you come across it, that's when spirit has it for you. One more, please, Holy Spirit. One more, please, Holy Spirit, fam. There we go. Thank you. It says, the first one says, give that shit up. Oh, this is two. Okay, it says give that shit up. There's better shit on the horizon. I know that's right. So whatever it is, fam, that you're being moved away from, trust and believe it's going to be replaced with something much, much better. Inner peace is my bitch. I know that's right. Acceptance better. Uh, ex acceptance better. Watch out. I'm coming for it next. I know that, baby, y'all are healing around this. And it is beautiful. Yeah. It says the power of serenity now. Pencil it, pencil it into your schedule. I know that's right. Heal on purpose, her fam. See what I'm saying? Give yourself closure is what I'm getting from this. Yeah. Come on, inner peace. I don't have all day. Be here now. Exactly. Trust the process, her fam. And I feel like that's what a lot of y'all are doing. But somebody here definitely go through a major tower moment behind you. Yep. But let's get into this energy real quick, fam. Y'all already know, though, if the message resonates, hit that like button for me. Ooh. I'm going to get face to face with y'all later, child. But right now. And you know what? You know what? Let me um just shout out to, uh what is her name? Carly. I'm so glad that they found her alive and well. No matter what the circumstances is surrounding her disappearance, fam, I, for one, I'm glad that they found her alive. I do feel like there is more coming out about that, but hey, that's, that again, no dog in that fight. Yeah, look, somebody here, they finna go through something because of something that they did to you. Being very manipulative. This could even be somebody. Listen her. Yeah, thank you, Holy Spirit. This is somebody that tried to come between your relationship. Whomever this is, this is somebody that tried to come between y'all's relationship. I feel like you have a, a very close-knit uh, uh, connection with whomever this person is. Yeah, you could be a Leo here, strength card, Leo or a Taurus. I, but there go that strength. I feel like strength is coming, healing. Something y'all not finna let something get y'all down. Yeah, the hangman. Some of y'all done stepped into y'all power and y'all ain't coming out for nobody. Then we get the justice card, Libra energy. And we get the four of cups here. Somebody here, they're, they're, they're finna regret something that they did to you, baby. And then you know what? It really feel like a glow up on your end. Somebody here finna see your ass glow up. This person ain't going to even be your type no more. They not even going to be an option for you. And I feel like that's what, that's what got going to have this person stuck in their head. But somebody here tried to come in between y'all's relationship. Who, somebody here. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, Ace of Cups here. Some of y'all are ignoring. Y'all finna get, get ready to ignore somebody because somebody new is coming in here. Yeah, some of y'all could meet somebody at work. Yeah, somebody is a stalker. I don't know where you work, but somebody stalks something or it has something to do with like a, like a warehouse or something like that. You know what? Somebody else here, they're having tower moments, fam, because you're not interested in getting their ass back for whatever they, they did to you. You're showing real compassion, real, like, inner strength here. Somebody is really holding themselves back, and you're doing a damn good job. So that is going to cause whoever this is that did whatever they did to you, fam, to go through a tower moment. Because it's like you're obeying, uh, you're obeying spirit at this time. Spirit said, don't. Your ass did not. They said they got it, and baby, yes, they do. Somebody's finna go through multiple tower moments. Like, I'm feeling like all at once behind something that they did to you, something that they said about you. If this is your co-workers, man, they really better watch the fuck out. Something that could even be going into the justice system. If somebody tried to get y'all caught up in like a... Uh, justice um like a legal case yeah that shit's coming out it's gonna be balanced yeah some of y'all could be in aquarius or you're dealing with one leo taurus pisces libra aquarius let's see here what is really going on with this energy holy spirit I don't know if y'all found, like, somebody talking to somebody else or something. What the heck is this? Yeah, look, we got the Scorpio with the death. And yeah, something here. And you ended something. And you're glowing up. You don't need somebody for something. And this is their karma. Oh, thank you, Holy Spirit. It's two people going through karma right now. For something that they did to you. Somebody here with you were in a relationship with. Somebody else is the person that came in between your relationship. These two people are going through karma. Whether they are still in the relationship or not. Both of them are going through karma now. Because of the shit that they did to you. While you were in a relationship with this person. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody could be a. I think August is um, Leo. And then there's a. Um. I'm seeing Sagittarius here. There's a Leo. There's a Sagittarius. I'm feeling real Sagittarius energy coming through her fam. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we got Cancer coming through her with the chariot. Yeah, it's like moving forward. Y'all move forward with love. I know y'all want to... <laughs> Yeah, no. Yeah, exactly. Empress, stay in your divine energy here going forward, fam. Don't let this, this whatever this is, take you back to the person that you used to be. Somebody here is having a major glow up, or you've had one, but I feel like this is a, a, a some future energy for someone here. It could be a Taurus, Libra, Pisces. This is future energy. Somebody here is glowing up. It's all about a mindset here. And somebody here has accepted the mission. It's something about changing the perspective, changing your mind. You know what? It really feels like, fam, like this is like learning a lesson over and over and over again. But you're in different energy every time you're being put to the test about whatever this is. That's really what it feels like. It feels like, you know, when you were in karmic energy, you were put to a test. Then when you went to... You know, pre-emperors, you were put to a test. And now, you know, you're an emperor, you're going to be put to a test. And it's like going forward. It's like, yeah, it's a test. This keeps coming up. It's all about learning a karmic lesson. See, the thing is, spirit want to make sure you're not going to slip back into whatever this was before you glowed up. That's why whomever this person is or these people, they're no longer options for you. You no longer resonate with these people or you won't. The energy between y'all won't even be the same. You will no longer find this person that you were in a relationship with. You won't even find them attractive at all. 
whomever this other person is, whether it was a family member, a friend, a stranger, whatever. It's like, there, it doesn't matter anymore. And that's where spirit is like, you. somebody keeps saying, okay, I'm over it, I'm over spirit. Well, no, are you really? Before they move you to the next level, are you really? Oh, if the message is resonating, hit the like button for me. Yeah, look. It's something about communication here, the way somebody talk. Hmm. Yeah, are you going to... See, somebody here, it's like somebody before, you couldn't close your mouth. It had Everything had to have a reaction. It's like, now, is it really worth it? Yeah, the nine of swords here. It's all about reacting to something. Are you going to stay in balance? Or are you going to let this get the best of you with this nine of swords here? Let's say somebody is not talking to you, uh, Empress. You know, everything between y'all is like up in the air. It's on hold. It's on pause or something like that. Maybe somebody here, they are, you know, choosing to go in a different direction with someone else. How are you going to handle this going forward? Because I see elevation on the horizons for somebody here. There's better shit on the horizons. Accept better. Watch out. I'm coming for it next. Acceptance. Uh, better watch out. I'm coming for it next. It's time for y'all to give yourselves closure about whatever this is. Yeah. It's time to pencil that shit in and be adamant about it. The chariot. Be determined to, you know, accept what's going on here right now. Accept what's going on. But give yourself closure about it and move forward without all this um, uh, cussing people out or calling people out or, you know, exposing what the fuck ever. Yeah, without staying up all night, crying, things like that. Make sure you stay in balance. That's what this is about. Staying in balance. Because there's something here that's trying to come in for you. There's better shit on the horizon and the Ace of Cups and uh, the Justice. But are you going to actually let this in? Are you going to let this situation right here allow you to miss out on whatever this opportunity is? I heard somebody talks in their sleep. I don't know what this is. Somebody feel like it's best to, you know, just not talk to somebody right now. But you're keeping this on your mind. Mm. Some of y'all honestly, yeah, it could be an Aries here as well. Some of y'all honestly, right now, it's best in order for you to remain in your divine energy for you not to have any contact with this person. Whether that be, you know, text message, phone calls, social media, something like that. Some of y'all right now, in order to balance out your energy, social media is, is a no-no. You need to like, I can't tell you what you need to do, but it would be best for you to take a break, like step back from social media here. Yeah. You have to, honestly, in this situation, fam, whomever this is, you're going to have to let them go and do whatever it is they want to do while still remaining in control of yourself, your emotions, and your thoughts. Because you create your own reality. If you believe, see, this is something else too, because I feel like somebody is in their head, like, because somebody is not answering the phone or Answer to take something, somebody they always gotta be with somebody else. If you keep thinking that fam, then ultimately that is the result that you're going to get. So keep those thoughts positive here. Yeah, tower on the bottom of the deck. Somebody here is holding on to a person. That the most high has been trying to get you away from so they can put you in a better position. So it's important to, to think about that as well, fam, when it comes to this situation right here. 
Yeah, we got the Ten of Pentacles and we got the Four of Cups. That says wealth and that says luxury. Some of y'all, there's a blessing on the horizon for you, but you're holding on to somebody that it's not meant for. It's not meant for this person. And most I know if they give you this blessing right now, you're going to run over there and you're going to share it with whomever this is. And most I is like, no. So that's why you're being moved, transitioned away from this. That's why communication has stopped. Some of these people are karmic individuals in your life who you don't, you're not supposed to be giving your time or your energy to. Yeah, Knight of Wands here. Somebody don't deserve y'all. But it's weird because whomever this person is, they, they, they feel like it's a privilege. I'm not sure if this is a privilege for you to be fucking with them or for them to be fucking with you. They feel like it's a privilege for you to be fucking with them with this Knight of Wands and this devil. Capricorn energy as well as uh, um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. And we have Emperor right here, Leo right here. And I felt uh, strong Sagittarius energy a minute ago. So y'all are dealing with someone who's very toxic in the first place. That's why y'all, this, they go Emperor again. Y'all could definitely be dealing with an Aries or you are one. But it's all about balancing out and maintaining your control. Pretty much taking your control back. It's time to take your control back from whatever this situation is, fam, so you can be ele uh, elevated to the next level. So whatever this is that you're finding out or you're having to come to grips with, it was meant to happen this way. So I'm here and let the chips fall where they may, fam. But just know you're going to be fine. Yeah, the moon card here. Ten of Wands. It's a lot of hidden emotions I'm feeling. But I also feel like something is coming to the surface. Okay, y'all. So tap in. Yeah, it could be an Aquarius here. But I feel like healing is coming as well. It's like, listen, there's something here happening or it's about to happen. Or, you know, this could be past energy. But I feel like it's something going forward here. There's something here that's going to happen that's going to bring a lot of shit to the surface. And it's going to make y'all want to boil over. This would be the perfect time for you to call on your angels. Because they right there, they want to assist you with whatever this is remaining, you know, balanced and in control, you know, staying positive here. But it's like, damn, nobody actually knows what I go through. Yeah, like, I understand. Like, I I feel, yeah, Empress, again, somebody here could be a single mother. But I'm telling you, something here is coming in for you, Empress. Your Emperor is coming in. Ace of Cups, the Emperor, and the Empress. The Chariot. You're being elevated to a different level, fam. You're being elevated to Empress status. And your emperor is coming in. But it's important for you to give yourself closure about this situation right here. Fam, there is something big coming in for y'all. And everybody cannot go with you. You can't take everybody. Whatever this blessing is, it's not to be shared with these people. You've been waiting on this to come in and here it is. You have to be separated from these people in order to elevate and receive this blessing. Yeah, four of swords here. I don't know somebody, I don't shit, somebody baby daddy went to jail or something. I don't know. But I see somebody um, going to jail. Yeah, and then we got the six of wands here. See, it's like no matter what it is that's going on, people going to jail. It's like people leaving your life for different reasons. I'm telling y'all, there is somebody here going through tower moment. And this could be but this person or these people are going to jail. Something here was a temporary win. Y'all winning and y'all don't even see it. Most times doing shit in the background that y'all can't see. And that's because until you uh, detach from these people, you're not supposed to see it. You're not supposed to receive it until these people are gone from your life. But I'm telling y'all, it's y'all winning season here, uh, Spirit. is saying, yeah, Virgo energy. 
uh, two of cups. It's something her. It, baby, I can't tell y'all this enough. Look, Hermit, two of cups and then five of cups. If somebody leave your life, let them leave, baby, because they weren't supposed to be there in the first place. These people leaving your life was hidden victories. Everything you went through is leading you to where you're supposed to be, where you're supposed to go. You're in elevation mode. That's another reason why y'all are isolated. Y'all don't feel like going out doing anything. It's ascension. Y'all are being elevated, promoted in the spiritual realm. Y'all can't have everybody and they, they tend to uh, one's energy coming around you. Your energy is sacred right now, uh, Empress. Period. Your energy is sacred. It's time for you to come back into balance with yourself. Somebody else here, it's something going on with you and your children. Spirit wants you to balance that out. You can't go to this next level until you make peace. Give yourself closure about whatever this means to you right here, fam. And I'm going to leave it right there. Y'all, if the message resonates, y'all hit the like button for me. Comment, subscribe, share. All that good stuff. Personal readings are open as well as the 11, 11 questions. If you would like to take advantage of that, um, fam, all of that information will be in the description box below. Y'all, if you have it, please turn on the notification bell so you can be notified whenever I do upload. But yeah, fam, it's always my pleasure. Thank y'all for allowing me to read for y'all. I'm sending y'all love and healing energy wherever y'all may be in this crazy ass world, fam. And we will most definitely get back up.